I'm your friend, Dr. Charles Apoki. It's about 12 midnight in Bucharest, Romania. Beautiful country, beautiful city with good architectural designs from several generations. I stumbled on a video of Duncan Williams, Bishop Duncan Williams preaching and attempting to raise funds. And he was telling some fabulous stories about what he saw in heaven, in the spirit realm. Maybe some of us are not uh, spiritually deep enough, but if we continue like this, with all these tales and fables, we will discourage people from becoming Christians. And it will become the, the Christian faith will become something of a mockery. One of the key statements he made was that he saw a man with a shining Range Rover in heaven. And to justify himself, he said that, what do we think that the streets of gold are made of, I mean, made for? That cars will drive on them. And then somebody made it, uh, asked a question, where are the petrol stations? Who will be the mechanics to repair those vehicles? They might sound funny, but the truth of the matter is that in an attempt to make people believe that the man who was riding that Range Rover in heaven didn't have a Range Rover on earth, but that was his dream car, and he gave a lot that the people should give so that in heaven, most probably they can have jets. He talked about uh, the city of T.L. Osborne in uh, heaven. We didn't hear of cities in heaven. We didn't hear of cities in heaven. Even the New Jerusalem and the New, the New Jerusalem is not in heaven. So, all these fables and terrible stories that these men, they are not Duncan Williams, he's not a small man, he's not a young man. He's schooled and under Archbishop Benson in the house has been through a lot of experiences in life. For him at this his age to be talking about seeing Range Rover in heaven is very, 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 very absurd. And the major problem, in addition to the things I've said before, is that there is donor fatigue. The people are tired of giving. They have given and given and given with promises. Hope capital. And a lot of them are not seeing the benefits of their giving. A lot of them have given and given and they seem to be poorer while those they are given to the apostles' feet, they seem to be getting richer. And so they are discouraged. And to cajole them, that's why people are coming up with all these terrible stories. And the more you do that in this dispensation, the more you drive reasonable people, the more you drive young people away from the church. Many people are disgusted, disgruntled, and feel dissatisfied with the messages men older than I am or my age bracket are preaching. In those days, it was young boys that were behaving like charlatans and misbehaving, and um, we, the elders, were supposed to correct them. Now it is elders that are being corrected by young people. I think it is sad. A lot of them, you have preached for so long. Why don't you retire? and let other people take over from you. So you didn't have an exit plan? Duncan Williams, this Range Rover you saw in heaven, is sad, is it? What is, maybe God was representing something to you. I don't understand. I don't understand. Or maybe, I don't understand. I don't understand. The time has come for us to go back to the Bible and stick to the simple truths of the Bible. If we want money, let us be productive as businessmen. 
Duncan Williams should have set up businesses all over Ghana that will have been generating revenue for him at this stage. They had the privilege of starting very early with Archbishop Benson in the house. They had the privilege of going to America very early, but they couldn't set up institutions that are self-sustaining. It is sad. Anyway, I'm your friend, Dr. Charles Apoke. I have a conference coming up on the 8th and on the 9th of November. It is tagged becoming a person of influence. It's something you should not miss. Send a message to plus 234-80-21-21-9262 on WhatsApp. Please don't send another message to me. You want to join the, the seminar. Send a message to plus 234-80-21-21-9262. He is the admin. I have many things on my mind. God bless you.